Welcome again to Firecasts. In this episode, I want to talk with you about a very important thing, your identity, but much more importantly, your user's identity. We offer a suite of products that help you get your users securely signed into your site and apps. And once they're in, if you want, you can then more deeply integrate with Google products like YouTube, Drive, or Contacts. But as a developer, it's sometimes confusing when you're faced with so many different options for building sign into your app. So in this Firecast, I'm here to help. First up is Firebase Auth. Now, if you're building something new, whether you're using the Firebase database or not, Firebase Auth to me is the natural choice. It provides a complete authentication system for your website or your mobile apps, and that's Android or iOS, and it includes all backend services. It also offers the open source Firebase UI so you can quickly implement auth best practices into your app in a way that's easily customizable to fit with the rest of your app's visual styles. And did I mention that as well as Google Sign In, it also supports multiple identity providers such as Facebook and Twitter. Now, you might have an existing auth system in an existing app and you aren't yet ready to make the full leap to Firebase. Well, that's okay. The one thing you can do to make it work better is by using Smart Lock for passwords without doing any migration away from what you're presently doing. Smart Lock for passwords will help people to sign up with a single tap. They can remember how they've signed in and it will help keep them signed in automatically across all of their devices. And this is done with client-side code. You don't need to mess with your servers. Another option is if you don't already have auth on your app or site, and you aren't yet ready to make the leap to Firebase, well, don't worry. You can still build a seamless experience for your users with Google Sign-In. This lets them sign into your app or site with their Google credentials, and they also become authenticated across all of their devices. And of course, it will integrate with other Google services, such as your calendar. It will even allow over-the-air installation of Android apps when users sign into your site. That's pretty neat, right? And that's it for this Firecast. Hopefully, I helped shed a little light on the options that are available for you. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. We'll get right back to you. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you.